Was it widely known among law enforcement that this was even a crime? <clears throat> well, that's a great question. So I don't have any survey data to show what they knew. Um, what I, th I think it is safe to say that many law enforcement officials believed that at least some homosexual activity was illegal, and I'll tell you why. Anise Parker, who's now the mayor of Houston, is one of the people I interviewed for this book. And she was involved in training for uh, Houston Police Department recruits when they would first come onto the force. There are two police departments near. There's the, Harris, there's the Houston Police Department. There's the Harris County Sheriff's Office. The Sheriff's Office is the one that arrested Lawrence and Garner. The police department, she was involved in training. She would begin her training sessions by asking the new recruits, please raise your hand if you uh, believe that it is illegal to be gay in Texas. And all of the police officers, she said, would raise their hands. Yes, we know it is illegal to be gay in Texas. Well, of course, it wasn't illegal to be gay in Texas. It, was Ill it wasn't even illegal to engage in any kind of affection with another person. Only specified acts were made illegal by the law. But by the time that this law had gotten down to the level of enforcement and understanding of the cop on the beat, it was illegal to be gay in Texas. And so if you were found to be gay somewhere, you were liable uh, to be uh, you know, taken to jail, or harassed, or, or told to move along by the police. Um, I, I think that's a pretty good indication of, of what. But how many knew? I mean, uh, Quinn, the lead officer that night, said he kind of knew something was illegal about this, so he called the district attorney's office and he said, does it matter where the offense occurs? In other words, he had found them in their home. Does that make them immune? Uh, so that I can't cite them and take them off to jail. And the person looked up the statute and read it and said, it doesn't say anything about homes being an acceptable place. It's just the conduct. So you can charge them if you want to. And he said, I'm going to charge them, and issue them a citation, and Lawrence talked back to me so much, I'm going to take them to jail. <laughs>